Each line of this computer program creates a string variable. Each variable will be based upon the string class. Consider the first program statement and we can see an object is created and the object takes up this name. We can see the second program statement produces this object with this name. The third program statement produces this object that's labelled appropriately with this name. You can see the value of the various objects are taken from here in the code and the labels that name the various objects are taken from here in the code. All of the objects have been based upon the definitions that appear in the class. Once the class has served its purpose, attention turns to the various objects in the computer program. So this computer program will produce three objects as you can see here. All of the objects have their own value and their own name.